Okay, Brian. Uh, thanks a lot, Brian. You've described uh, your concern over, over crossing the line of the Hatch Act from the podium. But can you talk about the president himself? The president is not covered by the Hatch Act. How does he think about uh, the red lines when it comes to his use of office to advance his political aims in his reelection? Do, what are, do you have anything specific? Are there parts of the White House that he won't use for political activities, for example, like the Oval Office or the South Lawn? And we saw the previous president use the South Lawn and the South Portico as a backdrop for accepting the nomination of his party. Are, are there red lines for the president himself on, on how he'll use the office in the White House as a backdrop for his political campaign? So look, you know, the president uh, uh, is proud to have restored the rule of law uh, in his administration. And I can tell you here and I can tell you now that he will not exploit uh, his the uh, his office with conventions at the White House like it was done in the last administration he will not do that uh, in his uh, on the South Lawn in his administration I can uh, uh, I can assure you that will not happen uh, in this administration what about the Oval Office or, or using parts of the White he House he will not measures? exploit he will not exploit uh, his office uh, to uh, for political gain in the way that we saw in the last administration.